All right, now this might look familiar, and that's because we're at the room with that where that giant flower fell through the ground. So it's uh, showing that we're almost done. So what you need to do to actually get back out of this area is first you want to use the Deku Leaf on this uh, turbine right here. Well, if I can actually get it right, okay. And then jump in this. Oh, what the heck? Well, if I can do this right. Because you need to do this. Okay, well, I get, I, obviously you can't blow it two times in a row like I was doing. Okay. And it only stays like this for a certain amount of time, but you want to jump in this Deku thing, and then you can just use your leaf to get out. Okay. Uh Oh. Okay. Remember this? This is the door I came through that I thought was the right way, but it's actually not. But now we need to come through here. So go and grab this this uh chest. And it's another joy pendant. Okay. Yeah, like I said, the first few dungeons in this game practically hand these to you. But uh it's good that we don't have to uh, try to search too much for him. And as you can see, we are at the uh, room that leads to the boss room. But we're not ready to fight the boss yet because we still need to get um, another treasure tart. But I'm going to go ahead and uh, uh, burn the top of that jar off. And. Okay, so now we want to actually go into this jar, which will take us all the way back to the beginning of the dungeon, but uh, that's actually where we need to get to. And it almost shot us right into that uh, choo-choo. That wouldn't have been very good. Okay, and we need to make our way all the way to the top of this room. So that's where we're headed. find the right platform to get to, which I think is going to be this Deku thing. <gasps> Jeez. I did not want to have to uh, make my way up all the way from the bottom. Okay, and look all around. That way I'm going to actually get to the right platform. And I guess it's going to be this one. Right at the height of the jump. Yeah, make sure you uh, bring out your leaf like right at the top, uh, the height of the jump. Okay, can land in here and make our way over here and uh, yeah, we don't want to jump over straight over there. We wanna get over here. Assuming that I make it. Oh, that's not funny. That's not funny. That's not fair. That's cruel. That's just cruel. That's mean. Well, why would they do something like that? Jeez. That wasn't very nice. And they just put the, like the Deku Baba like right there. So you're probably thinking when you see that you're like, oh, another thing that'll help us get up there. Yeah, that's nice. That's a great way. To, uh, that's a great thing to get to. And then you actually try to get up to it, and then it's like, bam! Right in the face, Deku Baba. Sucks. Okay. So let's get over here. Oh uh, no, not, not. We don't want to uh, get over there. Where do we want to go? Oh yeah, right over here. Duh. Okay. And then I'm gonna try to get over here, which is what I should have done in the first place. Jeez. <laughs> Alright. Uh, 
wait. Okay, and yeah, this is where we need to get to. Let's kill this. And we get another treasure chart, which is what this is. And this is the last treasure chart. And it's actually number one in the uh, actual map thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know why it doesn't let you speed that up, because it you go through it like 50 times. Okay, now we need to head to... Um, this room that's right below us. Uh, don't hit the tunnel. Okay. Back in the main room, we can go through the jar. And now it's boss time again, but hopefully this boss won't pull me as bad as the other one did. But this boss is actually pretty easy, so I don't know. All right. Oh, look, it's my car. Hey there, my car. Yeah. Uh oh. Uh oh. No. 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 Ah, oh, ate it. That's not good. That sucks. You tentacles. Alright, so here's uh the Barnicade or Barnacle, whatever that one thing from Ocarina of Time was. Uh the boss of Jabby Jabby's belly. Alright, so this boss is a little easier than the one before. As far as how easy it is to actually kill. Uh-oh. Just watch out for its tentacle things that kinda like charge up to get ready to hit you. And you want to target all these tentacles up here at the top. Okay. Try to take him out fast, but try to avoid getting hit by the tentacles. Because you don't want to uh, get hit. Alright, that should be it. And then when it falls, you can come in here and just whoop on the boss. Whoop on it. Whoop on it. Whoop on it. Oh. But watch that you don't get swallowed up. Because to swallow you up and spit you out. And then the tentacles will come back. And watch it because all the tentacles will be charged. Like when he first starts out, so be a little careful. Okay. Try not to be too try not to be too greedy with time. So just take your time. There's only one left. Yes. No? There's still another one? Okay. Ah, okay, we need to do this one more time. Then we'll have him beat. I'm trying to rush on this because there's actually something I need to be doing right now. I need to get ready for it, but... Oh, well, what the heck? It hit the tentacles. Or the, the, the vine things. And they're trying to crush me into the ground. Okay. Oh, jeez. Okay, it's a good thing I got that fairy, so I'm not even going to worry about healing. Which I don't think I will, because... I should be okay. Okay. And... Boom! There we go. That boss actually went pretty well. And it dies. With one little last gasp of pollen air. And now we're so happy. Inside of the thing. Yeah. And then a swirl appears inside of the plant. Are you okay, Makar? Swordsman, are you the one who rescued me? No. You have my thanks. When all went dark around me, I thought my time on the earth was over. But why are you here, Swordsman? What? The great Deku Tree sent you. Oh, th that's right. Today's the day of our annual ceremony. Oh, I'm in trouble. I shouldn't be here. I should get out of here immediately. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and get our next heart container. You got a heart container energy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, now let's get out of here. Because we are done with this dungeon. 
we got both treasure charts, the tingle statue, the item and compass and map, so we are set. So, where's this going to take us? Oh, back to the Great Deku Tree. That's great. Oh, Makar, you have returned safely. I'm sorry, Great Deku Tree. I know you warned me uh, so many times, but still I did not listen. Do not worry, Makar, you are safe now. You must be more careful from now on. You have done well, Link. I must thank you for your brave deeds. Here is that which I have promised you. Please accept it. What is it? What is it? Oh, oh! It's a green dragon ball. That's great. Da! You received Forer's Pearl. The Earth Spirit, the Deku Tree, has seen fit to give you this jewel, a treasure of the goddess Forer River Lore. I don't know how to pronounce that name exactly. It is my hope that this pearl shall lead you to a fair destiny. All is well, Makar. Do not cry. Please, play your songs for me as you always do. Oh, that's right. We must begin our ceremony soon, before the day ends. I'm sorry to keep you all waiting. Let the ceremony begin. Oh, great, Link. As my thanks to you, I shall play even harder than I normally do. I hope you enjoy it. With his two little balls hanging there. Okay, this is <laughs> a Link. Yeah, that's nice. Ew. Jeez, don't sound like that. Ew. Uh-oh. Oh, jeez. Oh, he made the great Deku Chi jizz from his wood. He made his wood jizz. That's nice. He made his wood sprout seeds. Because you excited his wood, which made him spurt seeds. Deku seeds from his wood. The seed of his wood. Great Jackie Tree, this year you have once again produced some splendid seeds. Of course he has. These seeds we will continue to spread new forests across the Great Sea. Let us go, Koroks, to the seas. See you all next year. Take care. Farewell, Great Swordsman. May the winds of chance bring us together again someday. And in fact, we will. Um, because, uh... They are involved involved in a side quest, one that we'll probably do near the end of the game. So, anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and uh, next time on my walkthrough of Let's of Legend of Zelda: The Wind Waker, we will actually prepare to get the third pearl already. So, see you guys next time on Let's Play Legend of Zelda: Wind Waker. Bye.